As you know, Molly has gone missing, but I'm going to go back in time to find her. But first, never gets old. Now, Harper, I'm going to need you to make me go back in time. This may oh. be hard. I I'm not sure if I can do this. Yes, you can. You just did! Where am I? Where are we? Uh, uh, oh, Harper, is that you? I was just I at the Glowathon. Forever. We've been, we've been at the Glowathon partying all night. Man, that thing is the wild. The Glowathon happened a few days ago. What? So it worked! We went back in time. <gasps> we went back in time? Uh, well, you went to the future. Um, so, uh, I didn't <gasps> find Molly, future? so why don't we go back? <laughs> I didn't find Molly. We'll have really? to try again. I gotta do more research. Bye, guys. Hello and welcome to this awesome episode of the Daily Video Announcements. Today is Monday, October 24th, and I'm Charlie. And hi, I'm Harper. Now it's time where we all stand, place our hand over our heart, and honor this awesome country while we say the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, and please be seated. What a fun, fun, fun day last Friday. Way to make a glowathon and the field day happen, Sycamore Junior High. Fabulous shout out to the Brothers Grimm Spectaculathon cast and crew. What an amazing presentation. So much talent at the Sycamore Junior High. Watch out for future info on the spring production of Footloose. Okay, let's continue to check our school emails, people. Did you know that in our future professional adult world that emails are a main source of communication and getting the job done? Remember, this is the last week of our court, first quarter. The quarter ends this Thursday. Keep your grades up, do your homework and classwork, study for your tests and quizzes, and finish strong. Also, check the lost and found table for any missing items. The table is overflowing if you're missing a sweatshirt, water bottle, device charger, etc. Check on the table. It's right by the main entrance under the welcome sign. Take time to freshen out and clean out your lockers too. All right, happy Diwali to our Hindu and Sikh friends that are celebrating today. Diwali, also known as the Festival of Lights, is a Hindu religious festival and one of the most important festivals within Hinduism. It generally lasts five days and is celebrated during the Hindu lunisolar month Kartika. Uh, some ways Diwali is celebrated are daya and lighting home decorations, shopping, fireworks, puja, which are prayers, gifts, feasts, and sweets, as, as well as our families gather together. Happy Diwali, my Hindu and Sikh friends. We have some exciting news regarding our upcoming holiday. Woo! Your voice has been heard, and we've been approved to wear school-appropriate Halloween costumes next Monday if you choose. Only, only, only if we abide and follow these rules and costume guidelines. Can we do this? Please, please, please follow the rules for the benefit of yourself and everyone else. Okay, here we go. Check out the screen. It says costumes can be worn only if we are to have no weapons or fake weapons, no masks, and we must follow the school dress code. No politically affiliated costumes must be able to sit, learn, and move throughout the school class without disrupting others and actively participating in class. Also, more exciting news, there will be a costume competition during your lunchtime. Yes, the lunchtime contest will result with four ca categories. Funniest, scariest, most creative, and a best group costume. So you can be creative with a group of friends to win a best group category too. Winners will be announced at each lunch and staff costumes can win too. Winner gets a large bag of candy. Oh yeah! <laughs> <laughs> and the lunchroom teaching staff are the judges, done at lunch, walk to recess, and recess. Oh yeah! Hey look, another activity option to plan for that day. If you choose to celebrate with your flex belt, flex belts are welcome to decorate their doors if agreed upon their flex belt teacher and the students. And the students will be responsible for this, to supply the materials. Fun, 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 fun. All right, we have a spirit day this week. October, we recognize Down Syndrome Awareness. And this Wednesday, October 26th, wear your yellow and or blue to celebrate, to support Down Syndrome Awareness. 
Next, remember to mark your calendars, calendars to support our 7th grade FTC robotics team at the October 29th Montgomery Farmers Market this Saturday. Let's review their outreach in Ad Now. Hello, peoples of the Sycamore Junior High. We are team members of the Junior High's First Tech Challenge 7th grade competitive robotics team. I'm Emily. And I'm Abby. And we are here to tell you about our fundraising booth at the Montgomery Farmers Market. We will be there Saturday, October 29th, and we will be selling fun fall decoration and our custom art project. We will also have informational videos about what first is and what they do. Every purchase will help fund our robot and spread first's goal. Hope to see you there. Bye. Thanks again, Abby and Emily. Now, oh wait, another interruption on our live video set. Wait, Captain Aviator? is back with his message. Good morning, Sycamore! I'm Captain Aviator and I'm here to talk to you about our upcoming wrestling season. Typically in the fall season, we have about 350 athletes. And then in the winter, we only have like 200 athletes out there. That means there's about 150 athletes who are not doing anything. Slugging around, sitting on the couch, mostly because they think they're mostly because they're cut from another sport or they think they're not going to make the team. I'm here to tell you that wrestling is the only non-cut winter sport. And if you, you don't need any prior knowledge, you don't need any prior experience to come out. We have an A team for the experienced wrestlers and we have a B team for the athletes who are just getting started. Everybody you wrestle, they're in your weight class. So they're your same size. So no worries there. We will get started off this season with the most basic steps. So you don't need to know anything coming in. We're gonna start from square one. Come join a winning program that always finds their way to the top of the podium. Wrestling is a very challenging sport, but it's also very rewarding. If you think you have what it takes, if you think you have the commitment to sign, sign up on final forms, go to the wrestling meeting. It's going to be in the Old Gym, during Flex, next Thursday on October 27th. Old Gym, next Thursday, I'll see you during Flex. Thanks, Captain Aviator. He's so sick and more spirited. I'm also considering wrestling. <laughs> Next up. Over to Carter's top 10. What's up everyone? I'm Carter with your top 10 survey results. Last week the question was, what is your favorite color? Uh, in 10th place we have lime with 25 votes. In 9th place we have white with 25 votes. In 8th place we have dark blue with 28 votes. In 7th place we have black with 28 votes. In 6th place we have red with 30 votes. In 5th place we have agua with 20, 33 votes. In 4th place we have gold with 35 votes. In 3rd place we have violet with 38 votes. In 2nd place we have green with 42 votes. And in 1st place we have blue with 84 votes. Thank you for so many responses last week. We had 153 of them, so keep it up. This week, the question is, what is your favorite type of video game? See you later, bye. Thanks, Carter. Next up, birthdays. birthdays. Happy birthday to Lucius J and Samuel J. Also, happy birthday to Cameron F, Josephine S, who celebrated during the Glowathon, and Jaylee J, Carter F, Ella L, Savannah D, Darsh S, Cody F, Louise M, and Sophie W. Yay. Yes, we hope you had a very special day. Now over to Mr. Harris. Good afternoon and happy Monday, Sycamore Junior High, and welcome to your video announcements. Tomorrow is the big day at 7.15 tomorrow morning. We the People is going to meet in room 200. This is a great club. You're interested in law, arguing constitutional issues, etc., etc. So that meeting will be tomorrow morning, 7.15 a.m. in room 200. You got questions? See Mr. Hammer or Mr. Gutermuth. All right. 7th uh, or 8th grade basketball. Boys. All right. 7th or 8th grade boys basketball. This is a reminder. It's an open gym today for 7th graders from 3.15 to 5 and for 8th graders 5 to 6.30. There will be another open gym for 7th graders 315 to 5 on Wednesday and 8th graders 5 to 630 on Wednesdays. Tryouts will begin on Friday. Make sure you show up with a white t-shirt with your name written on the back. All forms need to be completed on final forms in order to try out. All right. 
Congratulations to the entire cast and crew of uh, Sycamore Junior High Theater's fall play, The Brothers Grimm Spectaculathon. I heard lots of laughter and applause. You guys did a great job. Congratulations to all members of the fall play. If you're interested in wrestling, there's a reminder there will be a meeting in the old gym during Flex on Thursday, October 27th. Wrestling meeting, old gym, Flex Bell on Thursday. Those are your reminders. Technology Club is about to get started. If you're interested in all things tech, including but not limited to engineering and design process, computer software, 3D printing, robotics, computer hardware, and PC building, makerspace applications, VR, and gaming, gaming, then you may want to join the Technology Club. We will be holding an informational meeting after school in the Media Center on Tuesday, November 1st from 315 to 345. You will need a ride home at 345. If you cannot attend, please email Mr. Brenner or Mr. Gutermuth for more information. That's it for me today. You guys have a great day, a great Monday. Hey, we've got a short week this week, so enjoy it, and we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks so much, Mr. Harris. Now for the joke of the day. What did the printer do when it was listening to music? It was jamming. <laughs> <laughs> That's a really good one. All right, that's a wrap for today. We can't wait to see you tomorrow. Have a spectacular day, Sycamore, and make sure to stay classy. And go, go Mays! Mays!